my mom so they my dad called me she had triple bypass that's pretty we're at the hospital so you gotta be fast on your feet baby so um, pretty. i like this I don't know it's crazy I was telling um, one of my friends like I got to the end my husband literally gets out Friday and it's finally like just hitting me like I'm just I'm tired I want to sometimes I just want to quit and I want to give up four months might seem like nothing but baby one thing I learned is don't speak on the situation until you in it What's up, E gang? It's your girl Ebony Elbow back to you with another vliggity vlog. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, baby, because you gon' like it. And welcome back to my OGs, y'all. It is Monday morning, baby. We got what? Three days in a wake up. Okay, we got Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, yeah. So we got three more days and a wake up because we ain't even counting today. And they said they're supposed to let my husband out at like 5 a.m., which he sent a um, letter to the warden, baby. He want to come home. He talk, he done requested the people let him out at 12 o'clock midnight, baby. So he told me, I want to be sleep with you. So I don't know if they'll um honor it, but he sent a request. Anyway, I just left the ATM, got this daycare money, this little 140. Um, baby, I'd be glad when it's 140 over about the drop cam off the daycare. I did a Walmart order last y'all. When I tell y'all, when I got back in town yesterday, I had a girls' trip this weekend. If you haven't watched the vlog, go watch it now. Girls' trip in my not Miami, Orlando. It was so lit, y'all. It was so fun. Oh my gosh, so 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 fun. Anyway, I was tired and I slept and I never get to sleep. Once I got done with my business, I just slept. I was tired. I ain't do nothing. I did a send a I did a I lied. I did a couple um brand deal stuff, answer some emails, send over video for approval, but like editing, doing stuff around my house. I didn't unpack my suitcase, nothing. But baby, we gotta get this house together because my husband coming home, baby. And I'm so excited, y'all, because like he's this everything's gonna be I didn't take anything from my old house. All new furniture, everything is new. Like he hasn't seen anything, so I'm so excited. Yeah, like it's gonna be it's gonna be amazing. Let me go. I need to go to the store. Anyway, so because I didn't pick up my Walmart order last night, I didn't have any bread or lunchables for Cam lunch. I had like the snacks and stuff. So let me run in this store real quick and get Cam. Um, because I'm gonna drop him off to school before I pick up the Walmart order and see if they got like something for like um he needs some type of sandwich or lunchable or something he got all the other stuff so hold on i'll call y'all right back okay we're in come on let me take your tag come here baby we're in um dollar tree y'all see my baby got dreads now can your pants on backwards oh my god we gotta change your pants oh great they got lunchables so let me just grab this lunchable i gotta change your pants in the car what kind you want oh they just got one kind that's cool so yeah I'm at Walmart and getting my pickup order. And then I gotta run in there and get some, I'm gonna get some flowers for my mom. I'm gonna tell y'all about that in just a minute here. Hi, Ms. Bronson, you all good? Thank you. Have a nice day. You too. So yeah, I wish I had some um cash. I normally try to tip them. I don't have no cash on me. But yeah, I'm about to run inside. They took a little long time today for some reason. I've been sitting here about 15 minutes. So yeah, I got to run in here real quick and try to get my mom some flowers. She's having open heart surgery today. They took her back at 6.30 a.m. So she should be out by 10.30. She didn't want us to just sit in the waiting room and wait, which makes sense because we're just going to be sitting up in the waiting room looking. So the recovery nurse is supposed to call us when she come out and then we're going to head up there. But... I'm real nervous. Mama, this is probably my mom's third heart surgery since, you know, from childhood. Like, she had one when I was a little kid. And I just want her to get her health in order because, like, losing my sister, my grandmama, I can't, I can't do nobody else. My aunt, I can't do it no more. 
So I just want my mom to like, and I told her I'll do it with her. Like we can walk and it's genetic also. So it's already bad because it's, you know, genetics, your her genetic makeup, bad hearts. So I don't know. I'm kind of stressed out by that, but yeah, I want to go in here and grab some flowers and I'm gonna make my own arrangement and then I'm gonna go see her or whatever. She's supposed to be there for four days. Then she had to go to rehab. So she's getting the um the vert the long vertical cut. And then this one they go through her groin as well. And I think they said they need to clear the arteries and stuff. I don't really know exactly what they're doing because she hides stuff from us because she don't want us to be worried. Like she just popped this up on us, like, oh, I gotta have open heart surgery. I'm like, huh? Huh? But yeah, that's my girl. So I'm gonna run in here and get some flowers for her real quick. And probably grab me like a rotisserie chicken to eat on this week to make my salads with. Cause I don't really, yeah. Yeah, anyway, let's go in here. It's kinda cold out here this morning. Ooh, we ain't blowing too. Okay, I need a cake for Cam's school. They're having a pie, not cake, a pie, pie testing day. So, apple, I think everybody probably did apple. This is seven layer chocolate coconut. That's different. I don't like how they just open though. What the heck? All right, I'll try this one. It's different. And I got some guacamole, some spinach, and uh, chicken flowers. These look horrible. Oh my god. These are pretty. I like these. Pretty. And then I'm gonna mix it with something. Let's see. Oh my god, these are horrible. Okay, they didn't have any more to mix, so I'm just gonna get this and go. No, it's horrible. Ugh. Okay, y'all, it's later on in the day. I'm off work. I just picked Cam up from daycare and my mom so they my dad called me she had triple bypass surgery um she's out she got out this morning but they told us to wait six hours before we could come see her so she just i had been calling 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 and she finally called her phone was off she finally called me and she told me don't come she just want to rest but i'm still gonna go i just want to pop my i just want to physically see her myself pop my head in and I won't stay long because I know how that is when you just want to rest. But um, she's in ICU. So, yeah, I'm just really upset she didn't tell me she was having triple bypass. But I'm glad that God brought her through. And we just got to get it right from here. So, I don't know why I didn't grab balloons earlier. I'm going to go um, get some get well balloons from Dollar Tree. I got the flowers. Put them in a the vase. And then I want, I'm gonna get her some hauls because you know once they do the um, the anesthesia, the one that the tube down your throat, you have a sore throat. So I'm gonna get her some hauls for that. I'm sure she on like a strict diet, so I won't get her no snacks. But I'm trying to think of what else. Get her like some lotion. She probably packed her bag, so I will see if she need like lotion, shower gel, stuff like that. But knowing her, she probably packed her bag. But. Yeah, I just want to um, see her myself. So we about to get the balloons and go do that. Okay, y'all. Um, we went to um, Dollar Tree, but they didn't, they didn't, it was out of helium as always. So we at Publix when we finna pay $100 for some balloons, but I'm gonna do it for my mama. So let's go see what they got. Come on, Cam. Well, check the bogos while I'm in here. Let's see. Come on, Cam. Stay in front of me. Spaghetti sauce. It's good to put in your dressing, not just just that, just the seasoning in your dressing is good. Oh, you see balloons for Nana? Yeah, let's see. I should have came to Publix for the flower. They look much better. Well, she, we need to get a get well soon, Kim. She's sick. Well, I think this is the only one. Let's get this one. This is the only one I see that say get well. You see any more like this? 
grab these two. I'm really long. Okay, y'all, I'm back at home. I got so many packages from my subscriber. Oh my God, y'all, I literally cry. I got so many packages. I'm gonna open them real quick. I don't want, about to, I don't want y'all to be bored. I don't know if y'all like stuff like this, so I'm gonna open it real fast. Hold on. Okay, so. Let me um start with this one. This one was at my parents' house. My, uh, my dad got it for me. This is a gift card. The young lady reached out to me and she said that um she didn't want to send me just, you know, regular stuff. She sent me a gift card. Look, it's so cute. This is so cute. I never saw an Amazon gift card like this. And it's $75 on here. And um I'm recording. They're so rude. So yeah, um, and don't bring it right. it's heaven. That is so cute, and it's spelled H E V I N, heaven. And I hope I'm pronouncing it correct. I'm almost certain her name is heaven. But anyway, she reached out to me, and I thought that was so thoughtful, like for her to even reach out to me via email, and it sent me seventy five dollars. You are heaven sent. That was so sweet. So I got that, and then let me see. This one, um, and all this is stuff I wanted. All this is stuff I requested. So, this one is enjoy your gift. Really enjoy your content. Keep up the good work. Keep it, keep it coming, and I will keep hitting the thumbs up button from Michelle McCornell. Miss Cynthia McCornell. Oh, thank you, Miss Cynthia. That is so, I got to keep these because I like to tell everybody thank you. But these are some gold bowls. Y'all saved me so much money and y'all helping me with my husband coming home because this is like stuff we needed in the house for us getting the house together. So this is so cute. Just like look, this is perfect for like a salad. Look at that. Y'all know I like aesthetics. That is so cute. Oh my god, so cute. Okay, and then we got y'all, and I still got packages on the way. Okay, this is, your YouTube has been so inspiring. I pray God continues to keep your family and your channel continues to grow and show the world life, real life happens, but God is everything. But with God, everything will work out as it should. From Nisi, this is from Anthony's Too Real. Make y'all make sure y'all subscribe to her channel. Oh, this is this facial scrubber I wanted. Yes. Y'all are so sweet. Y'all, I get excited about stuff. I really do. I'm so excited. I can't wait to use all this stuff. Let's move on to the next one. It says, a gift for you. Enjoy your gift, Ebony. So glad that everything worked out for you and your husband. Celebrate and give thanks to God. Miss Cheryl Lawrence. Thank you so much. Definitely going to give praise to the Almighty. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Thank you so much. Keeping all these so I can say thank you. Okay, what is this? I'll get that later. Um, okay, where well, I put the scissors back. I'm trying to make this fast, y'all. I gotta get to the hospital anyway. Uh let me see, what's this? Oh, these are the, oh, let me see if y'all can see this picture. These are the shower racks I ordered for my kids' bathroom so they can sit. They, um, I didn't order, but I chose. They can sit there like, um, shower gel and stuff on them. They real fancy and cute. I'm going to have to get Boo to put these up because they require, I think, yeah, they have to be nailed to the wall. But yeah, they cute. I'm going to try to insert a picture from, um, from YouTube. I don't want to take it out yet because it's like real glass and stuff. This is nice. Thank you. I'm going to have Boo put this up as soon as he come home. And thank you so much. Oh, that's going to be so cute. Y'all will get to see it on the house tour. And what's this? Okay. This says, I'm so very happy for you both. Please say a prayer for my husband and I. We are in the same situation and trying to remain hopeful. Shamira. I hope that's pronounced correctly, Shamira. It's going to work out. God do everything for a reason. Stay prayed up. Keep your faith. 
and just try to stay tr strong through these trying times. As you just, I ain't no different from nobody. If I could do it, you could do it. I ain't no different. So let's see. What is this? This fancy. Let me see. I don't even know what this is. Oh my God, this is the massage kit I wanted. Oh my God, thank you. This is a massager. So let me show y'all. I wanted this because I'm dealing with, y'all know when you get lipo and you have the um, fibrosis. I'm, I have some fibrosis in my um, waist. I guess I didn't get enough massages. So yeah, this is cute. Oh my God. I'm going to use this tonight too. And it come in a little bag too. Oh, so exciting. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, girl. If you ever need to talk to me, just hit me up. We can get through this. Because y'all got me through this. Thank you. All right. This one is... Oh, this is my oven mix I wanted. This is from... Enjoy your gift. You are such an inspiration. I'm glad your husband is coming home. I cried with you from... Kim Denise Brown. Aw, thank you for crying with me, Miss Brown. These are my oven mitts, y'all. I love these. Let me show y'all. I wanted these. So cute. Durable for the um oven heat, for the heat, heat resistant. I like those. Thank you so much. They better be heat resistant. It look like, hold on. Yeah, they got to be. It say other men, so they got to withstand the heat. So, let me move on. Thank you so much. And then, let's see. What else we got? One, two, three, four, five. That's five people. Six. Six gifts. Seven, eight, nine. No, I'm at six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, because I opened three already. What's this? Have a good day. I don't know what this is. Let's see. Candle. Oh, this is my candle warmer lamp. Oh my God. I'm going to try to insert a picture of that too, y'all. Y'all know they say if you use a candle warmer instead of just lighting the candle all the time, it lasts longer. And they say it's supposed to, like, the smell is more potent. Yes. And it's really, really cute. Put this on my nightstand. It says, may God continue to bless you. And your family. Glad your hubby is headed home. Your content is a vibe from Stephanie Johnson. Thank you, Stephanie. This candle lamp is a vibe, honey. Thank y'all so much. Let me see. I'm gonna put a picture on the screen because I don't want to open it yet until I get my night stand up. Thank you. I feel like Christmas. Christmas in November. Oh, this is my strainer that I wanted for like when I be cleaning my lettuce and it's gold, of course. So yeah, this is for like when I do my salads. This is cute, it's cute, right, Ty? That's cute, oh my God. Okay, who's this from? Oh my God, they didn't put a note with it. Oh, they didn't put the little note. Let me see, did it fall under here? Oh, I hate that. They didn't put a note. I'm going to have to go online and see who it was from. I did have one that said she wanted to remain anonymous. So I, I got to go back and look and see what's this from her. But thank you. If this was from you, I will keep it anonymous. I don't, I want to respect your privacy. Thank you so much. Oh, yes. I know what this is. I'm going to be packing this this weekend. Okay, so this is two gifts. Let me see. Okay. All right. One, it says, I hate that they didn't separate us. So I know which one. Oh, they did. Okay. Oh, you bought me two things. Wait. Yes. Erica Miller bought me two different gifts. Okay. So it says, God doesn't play about us. Continue to trust God's heart even when you can't trace his hands. It's all good because... It's all G-O-D. Love and blessings from Erica V. Miller. Thank you. Let me sit that there. And this says, um, enjoy your gift. Love and blessings is upon you and yours. 
from Erica Miller. Thank you. She got me two things. So this one is the gold. Let me show y'all. Because we can use this today. Y'all know I'm on my gold ish. So it's the Saint Stopper. Um, so this is, is the catcher, the stopper when you want to wash dishes. Let me open it. We can use this today. It's three different kinds that I can use. So this is cool. So yeah, this is cool. Thank you so much. And it's this one. So it's three different ones. That is so cute. Thank you. I'm use this today. And then this is a travel set. So it opens up. It expands. Let me show y'all. I'm packed because Boo don't know I'm taking him out of town this weekend. We always go to the classic every year for his birthday. And he thought he was going to miss this year. But he don't know I got a little secret trip planned. So, yeah, we'll be getting on the road Saturday after we get done. With, after he do the buildings. He doing the buildings first. So, this is so cute and organized. This is a little set you can travel with. I like this. This is cute. Thank you so much, Miss Erica B. Miller. Thank you. So cute. Thank you so much, y'all. I'm so appreciative. I think that was everything for now. I know I got more packages on the way because I got an alert from Amazon. But thank y'all so much. I'm so excited. I'm so grateful. Like I said, I never thought anyone was going to actually buy me anything. So I'm so grateful. Like, y'all are so dope. Oh, let me put these flowers in the vase and we're going to head to go see my mom. I don't know where I put my extra vase at. So I'm going to have to let my mama get my good vase. But she's going to have to bring that back. I'm going to tell her she got to bring that back. I'm on my vase. She ain't a flowers girl. I am. I do flowers all the time. So... I hope these flowers ain't dead. I know. I didn't put them in the vase earlier from Walmart. So I got some from Walmart and some from Publix. I'm gonna put a um y'all put a little bleach in your flowers. It kills all that fun guy and stuff. Y'all know how that dirty water be going around in your flowers. It stop all that fun guy and stuff from growing. And they last a little longer. Little TikTok trick. So yeah. Let me do this real quick. Just sit on the table with the flowers. All right, let's go. We're at the hospital. Nobody ain't got you in there. The girls never want to be in the vlog. I would do. You do? Yeah. Cam, show them your dress. Cam got dress now. Shake your dress, shake your dress, shake your dress. 
<laughs> okay, y'all, I just left out the room with my mom. I'm headed to the car. I left the cough drops in the car, and she really need them in her chapstick. So she can barely talk. It break my heart to see her like that. Her face so swole, her whole body swole. She has a huge cut here on her leg. <sighs> it just did something to me, but yeah. Okay. Good morning, e -game. it's the next day. Um, we are doing Kim's homework this morning before school because we had a long night at the hospital last night. So I'm just about to um, finish helping him with this. All right, so we doing numbers. Um, trace, wait, it need to be darker. Like hold down on the pencil and trace it darker. All right, trace it. This? Mm hmm Keep do, do them over. See how I did mine dark? You do yours like that. What number is that? Ten. Good job. So go ahead and trace it dark. So, yeah. We doing that. I'm about to fix his lunch. And then I am going to the hospital to see my mom. Of I course. Mom. We love her, too. So, yeah. Um. She called me like, Kim, you want a piece of Lunchable? Yeah. She, yeah. Please. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma she called me like, um, One time. three, three o'clock this morning and I was up and for her to call me, she wanted to talk about something or maybe she wasn't feeling good, but the doctor ended up walking in the room when she called me. So I didn't get to talk back to her so i hope everything okay but i'm gonna see this morning <laughs> yeah um so yeah that's that i, I hate that we gotta do cam homework this morning y'all i don't like that but so yeah i'll talk to y'all in the car in just a minute okay Okay, we're at cam school. My daughter's taking him in. I'm about to go. I just talked to my mom. She doing good. She, she said they got her up and walking. So yesterday I told her I was going. Yesterday I took her chapstick and throat lozenges, which she really, really needed. She was so grateful. And I told her that I was going to um bring her like body wash, toothpaste, you know, stuff like that. And she said that my dad was going to bring it in this morning. She was like, you got my stuff, which the lady told me she, under anesthesia. She won't remember what she was talking about. That she had really strong anesthesia yesterday. So I guess she forgot. She told me don't bring it. So I'm going to just run. I, ha I already had the stuff at home, but that's okay. I'm going to run right the Dollar General and just rebuy the stuff and take that to her um, today. Cause I got her bag with me too. I just put it in here, return her bag so she can start putting her stuff in there. And she told me they took the flowers out of her room. I completely forgot that you can't have flowers in the ICU. So, um, hopefully she'll be moved out of the ICU today. And she can, um, have her flowers. But, yeah. So, yeah, I'm about to head to Dollar General when my daughter come out of daycare. Put taking Cam in. So, yeah. Okay, I'm in Dollar General. Let me find her stuff. So, let me try to get some bedroom shoes. Normally, they have stuff like that out for um, Christmas. I guess they are out of the travel size um, toothbrushes. I just bought one the other day, so I guess I'll just get this and a toothbrush and some toothpaste. Okay, so I got this. And let me get her some body wash. Let's see. She need a brush too. She need to comb her hair. Let me see. Just a little small body wash. Uh, my mama ain't bougie like me, so. Mm, these are all so big. Oh, travel size. Okay, so we got travel size. Let me get her deodorant. Let me get her a Listerine. Let's see. Do you want to scan a coupon? 
Okay, I hope y'all could see me. I'm in the parking garage at the, I just got to the hospital. Y'all, I had done gotten nervous because I don't know if you're from Jacksonville, you know, one of the parking garages collapsed at St. Vincent's Hospital. That's where I'm at. And baby, this thing just went to shaking, but you know the car, it be shaking when cars pass by, but baby, I'm traumatized. It's just, mm -hmm. But anyway, I'm about to, um, dang, it's all out. I'm about to go in here with my mom so let me show y'all what i end up getting got her stuff i'm taking her bag y'all remember she let me hold this bag for um my trip so i got the toothpaste y'all saw the toothbrush i got the travel size toothpaste um chris i got some vaseline advanced repair i got some um Listerine, and then I got her a bar of what well, I thought I did. I smell it. Wait, okay, I know I smell it. I got her some Dove soap, and then some um, a, just a little travel size deodorant. Cause hopefully she'll be going home Thursday or Friday. Today is Tuesday. So yeah, my husband can't wait to get here. He love my mama, and she love him. So he definitely want to see her. But anyway, let me go on in here. Y'all know I'm giving her privacy, so I'm not gonna record her in here. So yeah. Y'all look at this. Whenever this person come back to their car, they're gonna be so mad. Look at this. Like, how they gonna get in? That's crazy. Oh <sighs> y'all, it's time to go get camera from school. Y'all, so Boo wanted me to keep it a secret that, um, anyway, it's been hours later. Sorry, y'all. Um, Boo wanted me to keep it secret that he was coming home. He wanted to surprise the boys. So I got a look. I've been using my acrylic calendar that y'all bought me, that one of my subscribers bought me off my wish list. And it just says home. So the kids, man, trying to figure it out, even Cam. So Kaden was like, um, why does the calendar say home? What does that mean? So y'all, I had stumbled and I had to think real quick, like, oh, that's when grandma come home from the hospital because my mama do put to come home Friday. So you gotta be fast on your feet, baby. So, um, yeah, I hope they don't. I be trying not to talk about it on the phone around them because he want to surprise them. He want to go up to their schools and surprise them. So, yeah, and I want them to be surprised. I can't wait to like see their reaction. But yeah, we about to go get Cam. And I think I may start stop in Target to get something to cook. I saw this little pasta. It's like baked ziti, but the girl did it with like cottage cheese, like a lasagna. So I kind of want to try that and go by Target or Aldi, maybe Aldi and get the supplies. So yeah, I'ma just make a small thing cause it's only me and the boys. The girl's gonna be with my mama trying to, um, you know, help her or whatever. So it's just me and the boys until Boo come home. I might need to finish cooking my pork. We need to go and cook our pork cause my husband do not eat pork y'all. And baby, we have been showing, ah, ah, you hear me? We have been pork, chop, pork, pork, bone, pork. <laughs> Pork, 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 pork. So yeah, I'ma still, I'ma still incorporate my pork. He just don't like cross contamination, which I be telling him, man. You think these restaurants don't cross contaminate from the beef, chicken, the pork? They do. They use the same chopping board, all that. When you go to a barbecue stand, they chop everything on the same. I be telling him, but he be acting like it's such a big deal at home. But yeah, let me go get Cam. All right, I decided to stop in Ross. So let's look around and see what they have. It's pretty. I like this. Oh, that's pretty too. Cameron, which one you like better? These are cute. $9.99. Some faux grass. I should get this for my patio. That's a grass carpet. Yes, faux grass. Hmm. You think we should put it on the patio? Or a tile? What else they got? Come on, camera. Okay, let's look at the lamps for my nightstands. Oh, these are cute. What is this? This is cute. What is this for? Oh, Some soap. for soap. That's cute. 
can sit on your sink or tub. That's cute. They don't really have a good selection of lamps today. Nothing that catches my eye. So I'm gonna get this picture and the um gold chain. Let me go look at the clothes. Camera needs some jeans. It's getting cold. Come on, Cam. We got so much Christmas stuff out. Look like all this for little girls. Cute. Start early. It's girl stuff, Cameron. Oh, here you go, the boy stuff. Hmm. Alright, got these pants. Here, Cameron, hold that for you. Let's see what else. I really want jeans. I mean, keep saying I'm going to go to the children's place. Are these cute? I like skinny leg, not straight. A cute pair of Levi's. Some light jeans. Here, can we get this one too? Hold it. I think that's all I see. Okay, now we in um Dollar Tree trying to get the supplies to finish Cameron's project. So let's see. I want like a sturdy background to put it on. Poster board is too big, so. This feel kind of sturdy. All right, maybe we can glue it on there. So let's see what else. I think I sent all his crayons to school. So I'ma just grab some crayons. Oh, these glitter crayons, since it's on a glitter background. Okay, we could try that. I think we got glue. Let me look on the um, arts and craft wall to see. What else they have? I want like feathers. Hmm. This is glitter. Fall colors. Okay, I got an idea. Grab this. Give them some grass. Okay, y'all, I'm back at the house. I'm about to um make me a salad. I end up not going and getting kids. I mean, get enough stuff from Audrey to cook because I forgot I got to do a building tonight. So, I'm going to just make me a salad. I had bought the rotisserie chicken y'all saw from Walmart the other day. Um, We've been eating on it. So, what I think I'm going to do is just cut the breast up, the chicken breast, blacken it a little bit, put it on my salad, make me a nice little cute little salad. So, yeah, let's do that.
y'all this is how my salad turned out the kitchen is all clean so i'm gonna eat this one tonight and then i have these two for meal prep but i'm gonna wrap it up because i gotta go clean the building so i can get the kids home at a decent hour in bed bathed and all that so yeah i'll eat it when we come back but the kids have already ate turkey turned out the blue has to dry that's glue but it's the little grass and it's the turkey it's cute cameron good job high five good job so yeah that's it and to show y'all i did buy this picture we'll put it up tomorrow i think i'm gonna put it by the front door if it's big enough i don't want nothing too small but nothing overly too big either but i did get the picture and then I also got the pants for Cam. I think I showed y'all in that golden chain. So, yeah. Hey, y'all. So, we in the car. I'm um, headed to the building so I can get the kids home. Um, I haven't had to do a Tuesday building in a couple weeks because my daughter been doing it. But she at my mom's house. So, I'm tired. Um, Y'all probably could tell I got low energy today low vibrations just but once we get the kids bathed back back home bathing in bed um we'll talk about that so i'm tired and the drive where i have to go is probably like 35 minutes so yeah i gotta stop and fill up so yeah i'm just i'm over it y'all but 
We'll talk. Let me get to this building. Um, good morning, E Gang. It is Wednesday. I just got done cleaning my buildings. Um, it's 10 o'clock. I'm late for work. I should be clocking in. I'm never late from work. Y'all, I'm y'all see my lashes look crazy. I'm drained. Um, I didn't even come back on camera last night. I'm just kind of I don't know, it's crazy. I was telling on um, one of my friends, like I got to the end. My husband literally gets out Friday and it's finally like just hitting me. Like I'm just I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm so tired. And I think mentally it's more exhausting than physically. Although I am tired physically. Um, I'm tired. It's a lot with the kids trying to keep up. Both Kaden and Cam, like, you would think, like, they're in high school. Like, I don't even have to help Alana. Like, they, their work is so demanding. Like, it's just, even Cam being in VPK, it's just, and then trying to clean the buildings and trying to make sure I'm still a good mom and just trying to be a good wife and a good friend and daughter and then having to deal with my mama having this bypass surgery i'm just drained i'm exhausted and trying to work and it's like i got a cool laid-back job but it's still work got to be done and it's, it's gonna be a lot y'all i got I, I just i want to sometimes i just want to quit and i want to give up i want to I'm, I'm having one of those days where i just want to give up like knowing me i'm not but i'm human and i go through the motions and i'm even having one of those days where i resent my husband today because like if you wouldn't be where you was at things wouldn't be how they are i haven't did my hair um i was so excited about him coming home and i'm gonna be honest with y'all now like i don't even care but y'all know i'm bipolar like for real for real so I feel like that now. I might not feel like that later. And I might not feel like that tomorrow. And then I might feel like that tomorrow. I don't know. But I'm definitely going through the motions right now. I'm tired. I'm tired, y'all. I want to give up. I'm tired. And then even when my husband home, it's not like it's just everything going to end like that. Because he coming home broke. And now it's the lawsuit. And it's so much stuff that y'all don't know. So much stuff that I couldn't share. And But one of the things, you know, now that he's been sentenced, a lot of stuff they told me don't talk about until he was sentenced because he did, they didn't want them to try to retaliate against him. But it's a lawsuit um, being in place for Jacksonville Sheriff's Office. Um, even the fact that they're saying they didn't take our money. Um, they cut their body, cam body cameras off when they came in the house. They're not supposed to do that. Um, they saying that it, what they saying about the fun. It's just a lot of discrepancies in the report. It's a lot of stuff they did wrong. A lot of stuff my husband wasn't shouldn't even been arrested. That's number one. Um, it's just a lot. And y'all know these lawsuits they take forever. Like it could. This man told me like this could drag out for a year. More than likely, they probably will try to settle because they did a lot of shit wrong like i don't know so but even though my husband wasn't supposed to be arrested it's still the company he kept and i told him about the company he keep and the company he allowed up at our shop a place of business man so one of those days it's one of those days where i'm a little resentful and i'm a, I'm a little mad I'm tired. I'm no stranger to hard work. I don't mind working hard, but who wanna? Who who don't want an easy life? You know. Um. I don't know. I want to quit my job. I'm battling whether to quit my job or not. Um. YouTube is good money, but it's not steady, and I'm noticing that. I just really started making real money on YouTube. The last three months and so that first month was real real good the second month was good and then now this month i'm noticing it's like slow like so 
I have to make an informed decision. Like, I can't just quit my job depending on this YouTube money. Like, I got big girl bills. Like, it's a lot, y'all. And I'm trying to explain to my husband. Just at the, at the, at the first of the month, I'm putting out $4,000. Just, just on the first. We ain't talking about car insurance. None of that. Just, just between the rent at the shop and the rent at my house and just other stuff i'm four thousand dollars the first of every month that's what i put down so i need to be able to make an informed decision about just quitting my job um i don't know y'all it's a lot but i'm trying to like um my tomorrow my husband's birthday and i don't want to be like a sour puss and a debbie downer so I'm trying to pull myself together. I need to get the house together. Like I, you know, like that'll be his first time coming there. So I need to get the house together. I don't know. I don't know. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog and start another one. Try to get myself feeling better. I got a lash appointment later today. I'm gonna get my hair done. Try to look presentable. You know how we do. Like I had my I haven't been able to like physically touch or hold or hug my husband so in four months. So and I know some people probably like girl four months and nothing. Y'all just always remember don't ever speak on the situation till you actually been in it, baby. I know that seemed like nothing. But to have your whole world twisted upside down, to be the sole provider for your children, to try to make sure you hold everything. Well, I won't say sole provider because they do have their father, but in my household, the sole provider and just the companion, even the companionship. I know four months might seem like nothing, but baby, one thing I learned is don't speak on the situation until you in it. These four months been hard. I made it. But it been hard. It been hard. Not even just financially, mentally, physically, emotionally. I think emotionally it's been the hardest. But this too shall pass. Trying to get in a better mood about my husband coming home. Um, he said today, like, I guess he can tell it in my voice. He he it came out to him and says if I didn't want him to come home. And that's not it. I'm just frustrated. Um, which he understand. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog and start a new one. So if you see me with these same clothes on, it's still Wednesday. <laughs> but E game, I'ma go. I gotta pull myself together because this is not me and I don't wanna be um on camera being negative and just down. That's not me. I'm a bubbly person. So let me go try to pull myself together and I'll catch y'all on the next vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Keep me in prayer as always. I love y'all, you gang.